from a brand positioning, we needed to, in essence, go through a renewal. We play in retail, because uh, that's a rich heritage that we have. Uh, we have an ambition to also have a presence in department stores and lifestyle accounts, and also the food drug mass channel. Godiva's got some incredible products, but like a lot of retailers, they're experiencing the trend towards omnichannel and having to think about how do you create the customer experience in those boutiques so that when a customer leaves those boutiques, they carry that experience to online, to their tablet, to a department store. We chose to partner with Teletech Consulting because of our previous history. We knew the team, we appreciated the industry knowledge, and we knew that they would keep us on track. So as Teletech Consulting, what we thought we could really do was, was help them in a few different ways. What we tried to focus on really was the field and the boutique out outlets themselves, the boutique stores. We did some interviews, we did some secret shoppers, we did some surveys to figure out what was the difference that made the difference between the top boutiques and the average ones. And really that centered around the boutique manager. The boutique managers are really brand ambassadors that are leaders in delivering enriching experiences for both our people within our boutiques and our customers. So when you think about the traits of a boutique manager and, and what we found, you know, really passion was a key driver. But passion was something that it's, it's not necessarily a skill, it's more of a mindset and it's an attitude. And it's about taking ownership within the stores, not only for the results, but most importantly, around the culture within that store and how up for it the team are. It boils down to role modeling that um, and being able to coach and lead your teams in that aspect. I think the reason why we're focusing on mindset is that if we don't have the right person in the first place, why invest around skill building and behavioral traits? So we want to make sure that we have the right people right off the get-go. So everything that we do with Godiva and all of our clients is about trying to create sustainability within the business after we've been there. So for example, the training that's been deployed on this trait, which is called ownership mindset. We did it through a train the trainer, but Godiva will be able to continually train new people as they come into the stores and become employees. The learning program has been received exceptional across the field. Our conversion was 46.6%. Coincidence? I think not. It's been six months. It's been a ton of deliverables under a short amount of time. Throughout the whole entire time, we were able to have fun and laugh at the same time of getting things done. When I think of partnering with an organization, it's knowing that you trust that organization to do what they say they're going to do. And it, it, it's fun. It's a fun experience. They know that we're going to give them the best alternatives and guide them in a direction that's only going to grow the partnership and help them to really move into the future. 